Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is Ani here from the learning class. Today's tutorial is on how to install a chat button or a chat feature on your website. Chats are great because it gives you uh, the ability to connect to your clients in real time. Uh, the one that we're going to use today uh, is a great little app because not only it has the live chat feature, but it's got email feature, it's got WhatsApp. Everybody knows about WhatsApp, how great it is. Uh, it's got Facebook, Messenger, Telegram. I mean, I think it's got everything. So one app will do all your job. So without further ado, let's uh, get into a tutorial. Uh, but before we get into a tutorial, guys, uh, give us a like, share, comment. Uh, it just helps us. We are a brand new channel. So yeah, uh, just support us. Anyways, uh, let's uh, let's get into the uh, tutorial. So the app that we're going to use is called WhatsApp Chat and Share. As you can see, this one. So just go to your Shopify store and then just uh, just type in WhatsApp, chat, Telegram and more. So you'll see, you'll see this app that comes up. Click that. And then as you can see, I've already installed the app, uh, but just go ahead and install it. So once you install it, uh, you'll be able to see something like this. Yeah, so this is installed. So just click that. Okay, once you have clicked, uh, just scroll down and just click on customize app. So before we go to customize app, they have like some other features as well. They've got Pinterest, they've got page speed booster and some some other stuff like tiktok and all of that so not only they you know they have like a chat uh, app but they also you also get other features as well so that's pretty cool anyways let's click on customize app so once you click customize app it's gonna ask you there are three sections here chat style and share so we're gonna quickly go through each one of them uh this is where you are able to add the channel so first of all make sure your whatsapp chat and share is enabled so obviously i'm just disabling it so make sure it's enabled okay the next one is you can add channels so let me show you i've added whatsapp and email but just have a look what all stuff they support so they have whatsapp telegram Facebook Messenger, Twitter, you can have a direct phone, you can have SMS, email, Gmail, Line, Skype. I mean, the list just goes on, right? So pretty, pretty cool. One app and you can connect to your clients on so many different channels. For this tutorial, I've just put in WhatsApp and email. Now let's click on WhatsApp. So once you click on WhatsApp, you just put your number there and then i've just given like a sample name john doe so you can write the name you can write the label so you can just copy the way i have done it so you can just write support you can use a custom avatar so if you have like a special uh, you know you know like a small graphic you know or the photo that you want to use you can use that as well and then uh, and then we go to settings so always available online so i think it's always good idea to leave that on it's always available <clears throat> show chat box uh, hello i'm john from the support team of course you can customize it you can write things like hello i'm john from the name of your business how can i help you today anything like that Okay, cool. So that is your WhatsApp. And then the same way you can customize your email as, as well. So you can write the email address that you want. Again, the name. Yeah. Or you can just leave it the way I have left it. Okay. And, uh, and then as I said, you can add 
so many different uh, social media channels as well. Okay, uh, going back down, then it says settings open in a new window. So do you want the chat box to be open in a new window, which is not a good idea because you don't want your customers to go away from the website. So it's always a good idea just to have uh, the same window on your website itself. Show online channels only. Channels which are away according to the schedule settings will be hidden. So, uh, for example, you have five channels. Facebook, Twitter, Insta, email, WhatsApp, right? So, if one, of, if one or two is not active, they automatically will be hidden, right? So, if you want to hide them, you can check it. If you want to leave them on, you just leave it on, okay? Okay, allow the customer to leave a message for offline channels. Definitely keep that check. Show greetings message. So here you can write, hi there. How can we help you? Tap here to start. So I'm just going to leave that. You can see it's giving you a little bit of a sample message here. Again, you can customize this to suit your business. When do you want this message to be displayed after five seconds? So you can change that immediately, you know, so you can change that. Show pending message, increase your click rate by dis splitting a pending messages icon near your chat widget to let your visitors know that you're waiting for them to contact you. Okay, so this is again great. So you can, yeah, you can just leave it, just leave this at one, I would suggest. Uh, and then you have the option of placement. So where do you want this chat box, you know, on the right side or left side? Usually, normal standards are on the right hand side. Uh, distance from the bottom. So here you can actually customize the exact location. You know, do you want it? How, how much up do you want? Uh, how much right do you want? How much left do you want? So that's that. And then on mobile also, you can choose the position. So inherit left or right. <clears throat> okay, and then you can customize the text. So hi there, description. So this is again a great way of really customizing the way you want your text to be displayed, you know, your chat box to be displayed. So that is all of that. Then we go to style. So in style, uh, you can choose the color of the box. So this one, the chat box, I always advise that try to choose the color which matches your website. So if it's if there is blue, if that's the primary color of your website, then obviously go with blue. Uh, if the primary color of your website is green, then go with green. So I've just gone with uh, black for the moment uh, you can also choose the icon so there's quite a bit of different types of icon which is available so depending uh, what's your primary chat option you know if you're gonna have whatsapp as your primary chat option then I think you can have uh, maybe this logo uh, if you plan to have uh, Skype as your primary option, then you can have this logo. So you can have this logo. If WhatsApp is your primary, you can have uh, Facebook messengers. As you can see, the, the icon is changing, right? If you want uh, email as your primary, then you can have... Uh, so, just, so right now, I've just selected this one. But you can choose uh, what you prefer, right? Okay, and then uh, you can also choose a custom color. Okay, and then moving on, uh, sharing. So do you want uh, people to be able to share uh, your website on social media, which I think is a great idea to have. Uh, so you have to enable the sharing over here. Again, you can choose. So sharing is some this one, right? And then you can choose where do you want to position it. And then again, the mobile device, I just inherit or again, you can choose left or right. 
and then you can also customize this as well so you can have the color that you choose you can write the text i have just written share but you can just write this you can customize it the way you like it so i think that's it uh, it's a great little thing uh, i very very strongly recommend that you should have a chat box uh, it also looks uh, it also makes your website look professional and uh, trust me uh, by having a live chat with your client is going to really increase your sales i personally can vouch that i have live chat uh, all the e-commerce businesses that i have run uh, live chat the you know i could say the conversion rate of live chat in my personal experience has been almost 50% so if i have had 10 chats i've been able to convert five of them into actual sales so and i'm not a great sales person so you know if you if you are a good sales person uh, definitely this is like uh, a great little uh, tool that you should have okay so now that once you are happy with uh, all the settings just click save so now it's saved and let's have a look how this looks on the actual website so it's going to click this and so that's the website i'm going to go on a different browser Let's just go here. Okay, so that's the website, and there we go. So here it is. I'm just gonna click that, and as you can see, we install the WhatsApp and we install the email. So we've got these two. Of course, you know, if you install Messenger, Twitter, so you know, you're gonna get all of those as well. But uh, Yeah this is this is pretty much how you install uh the chat button so if you enjoyed this video uh and if you learned something really appreciate a subscribe a like comment uh yeah just uh, help us and um, we'll look forward to having another video for you soon take care and goodbye